Welcome back to Is It Playable? In this video we'll be taking a look at whether Cold Fear is playable with PCSX2 within RetroArch. I always was interested in Cold Fear. I don't know why, ever since I saw the box art for the game, it just made me... intrigued. It's like an old school, old style Resident Evil game set on a boat. Whether it's as good as the Resident Evil series, who knows? I never really made it that far. I never knew what I was doing in it. Which is honestly probably going to be the same deal for uh, this test. <laughs> oh god, it's got an awkward aspect ratio. What if I said yes? That didn't do anything. Screen config? Oh, there we go, it's fine. Shoot. No, it's because it's got a weird aspect ratio for the title screen, but it should go easy. It should clear up when we're actually in-game. Oh. But I did mess around with the screen config, so I may have screwed it up. Oops. Whoa. Oh, it's circle. I got a note about ammunition conservation. Screw that. That. Oh dear. Okay, it's not an old school resi. I thought it was laid out like that with the fixed camera angles and tank controls, but no, it's an over-the-shoulder game. My bad. Oh god. Someone died. <gasps> no! There got pistol ammo. Nice. God, the whole sway in side to side kind of hurts. Ooh. I went in. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, look. I am fully loaded with this ammo. Oh, oh, what the hell? That's kind of cool. A bit jarring, but kind of cool. It goes from... Not really third person, but to over the shoulder. <laughs> what the hell? Right, well, we saw a guy outside. I don't think there's anything I can do in here. Dun dun. We're gonna get attacked. Nope. We did see a guy out here, though. What the hell? I'll be honest, I don't actually know where I've been. Hmm. Maybe there's a way of getting inside the ship. Wait, can I get hit by this? Ah, oh, I can. <laughs> it doesn't knock me over or anything, it just kind of brushes against me, I guess. Oh. Oh god. Oh. Oh my god, really? That's what I had to do. Hey, I want to get the item. Oh, I didn't have any more ammunition. Isn't that a shame? Ah, oh, there we go. I made it. Oh god. <laughs> Just got shocked. Where you 
Combat? What? Oh, what? Oh, they're shooting at me. Excuse you. There we go, we got him. I win! So square is still the button to reload. I do like how I can loot them. Very nice. Oh, hang on. I keep forgetting it doesn't turn to whichever way the camera's facing. What if I do that? Oh wait, that doesn't do anything. I noticed that the valve in the back was... There we go. Highlighted. There we go. Nope. Oh, there we go. We're going in. I thought there'd have been like a zombie or, or something, but nope. One shot. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Hey, I'll take it. Got the camera. The controls are a bit awkward. Pistol ammo. Did I come in here for nothing? I did indeed. Hey, I don't mind. Works for me. Think about what to call it here. There is a little bit I want to cut out. Mostly when I was just running around the ship, not knowing what I was doing. Until I... Eventually came across the flammable... Uh, barrel, and I shot it, and then I'm like, Oh! This is where it wanted me to go. Of course! Ooh! Bit of a grisly sight, isn't it? Ah! Oh, it actually insta heals you. Interesting. What the hell is that? Is that a dog? I am not sure. Oh, I wanted the camera angle to change again. No, oh, never mind. But honestly, this seems pretty decent. The only time the game kind of craps, uh, craps out is basically when you transition from one area to another. Actually, that's not even true. If I transition from in the ship to onto the deck of the ship, it would crap out. But aside from that, it's been pretty much full speed the entire time. So, not bad. I would have to say that Cold Fear is playable, and that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, please like the video, subscribe for more, leave suggestions for games you want to see, and until next time, take care.